Welcome back to another reaction video guys. Today we're reacting to scary CCTV footage as you guys did request through our community tab which is absolutely awesome. Also it helps me know what you guys want to see next. I'm super excited to get into this video. If you guys are new here make sure to smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. It's nice to see new faces, it helps the channel grow, and as well as helps this video get in front of viewers like you. Other than that, let's hop on into the video guys. This bizarre video was uploaded to S. Koss's YouTube channel in December 2014. Looks like it almost like a graveyard. Taken from a security really nice fencing, that's location. for sure. At first, or it's like a car parking lot, maybe? By the camera. And while these could easily be dismissed as insects, it's what the camera captures next that is truly strange. Several white figures begin running along the outside of the fence. Then suddenly, a few of the figures leap over the fence and land motionless what? on the ground. Some viewers have suggested that the strange shapes are actually deer. However, the way they land after jumping the fence seems to rule this theory out. Dude, there's like smoke that follows them after they land. They appear still deer? and lifeless, almost as if they've deflated. Are you tripping? People think that that's As deer, uh-uh. That the video couldn't get any weirder, a long trail of light appears at the top of the screen. What is that? This is truly one of the more bizarre videos I have ever seen. Could it be possible that the mysterious white figures are ghosts or some other type of supernatural entity? Oh no, that's horrifying If anyone no. can shed any light on this video, I'd love to hear what you think in the comments section below. That's a little much. If you're seeing that kind of stuff, well, was there anything there in the morning? Like any footprints? I mean, when they jumped over the fence, there was like a mystical like trail almost that followed them. Twitter user Conspiration ESP uploaded this terrifying footage captured by CCTV camera. A bizarre figure has visited this residence late one night, and it has viewers seriously questioning their perception of reality. In scary recordings captured from a variety what? of cameras, you see a creepy person or creature running on all fours. Yo, that looks like happening. Michael Jackson from that horror game. The camera never captures close up. He's the on the search. It appears to be a cross between a human and a dog. That's a skinwalker. The entity moves on all fours like a canine, but when it comes closer to the camera, its body appears to be that of a human. Its skin is hairless and pale, but its head seems to be darker in color. Is it naked? Because of the appearance of the creature's body, some are apt to believe that it's simply a human running naked I don't know, that's... night on all fours. Unless that's in like Philadelphia, you got a lot of crockheads out However, there. The way it moves seems to rule out that possibility. The human body is built to walk upright, and no human could easily run with such speed and agility. Not a on chance. All fours. There are other That's horrifying. possibilities that explain these scary recordings. Perhaps this is a human, but one possessed by some sort of animalistic demon. What do you guys think? That's weird. That's a little Another much. The possibility is that the recordings show a lesser known cryptid called the Dogman. This creature, much like a werewolf, is a cross between a human and a canine. Unlike werewolves, dogmen live permanently in their in between state. Over the years, there have been numerous sightings of the so-called Dogman. Although witnesses have been terrified by the encounters, none have been harmed by this elusive cryptid. So whatever theory you believe, human, Dogman or demon, they're all just as terrifying as each other. Love to get your thoughts on this one in the comments section below. I will say, like, the Dogman fact, I mean, that does make sense. 110%. I mean, right on all fours. K9 action living in between both realities. I mean, I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments. She wasn't expecting to capture any ghost videos when she set up security cameras around her home. Unfortunately, a bizarre shadow has her questioning how safe her home really is, sending her to the internet for answers. The oh, has I do that all the time. Like, if I don't know something or like something's like really catch my eye, whether whether it be like something medical related something like anomaly related anything like that i'm on the internet i'm searching i'm going through browsers everything like looking for facts 
has multiple CCTV Let me know if you guys do that. Inside and outside her home. When watching the footage of her living room one day, she noticed something odd. A human-shaped shadow peeking in through the doorway. Okay. Oh. The shadow pops no. in a few times, standing out in stark contrast to the white door before fading away. Oh, no yikes. No trace of the person casting the shadow ever appears. On the first two appearances, the shadow is indistinct. It appears to be human in shape, but it's hard to make out a defined silhouette. That looks like a nice home too. Oh, I feel bad for you. Just get, hey, just sell it. Good resale value. Don't tell them that it's haunted. Actually, don't do that. That's illegal. You have to notify new buyers that if you know about that stuff, you have to notify them that it's haunted. Don't you ever come back? In the video, Don't you ever come back? Sure That's that horrifying. If I've seen that, the shadow of a real person. However, none of the other cameras provide any evidence of an intruder entering or exiting the home. Well, facts. If a person had broken into the house, it would have been difficult to evade all of the camera feeds. That's this actually the horrifying. To believe that she is in fact dealing with a spiritual entity. You better go. Don't you ever come back? In That's this weird. Piece of creepy footage. Two men are sleeping. Poltergeist in dorm room. Restless and are shifting their arms and legs around. Hmm. Since sleep is a time for the brain to relax, some experts have suggested that humans may be able to sense paranormal activity more easily in this state. You know, what I hate watching. I hate watching those videos of, like people recording themselves while they sleep. Fifty seconds into the recording, the dorm room door opens got some weird up. stuff that happens. It open on its own. Like, I wouldn't even want to know. No there. Nah, fam. Twenty seconds later, something barely visible enters the room. Viewers may notice a slight shift in the image. After a few more seconds pass, the legs of the man who is closest to the camera start to lift. Oh, no. Nah. The initial lift doesn't wake him up. He starts to stir awake as he's yanked toward the end of the bed with his legs being pulled up. Into oh, the he is up. Yo, could you imagine waking up halfway to the ceiling? High enough for him to almost be in a headstand, the man realizes that he's being hoisted up and starts oh, to Oh my goodness. That's pulling him along. That would freak me. I would be done immediately. I'd be out. I'd be sleeping outside in a tent. The bed, but at the last moment, it releases him. Oh my goodness. He sits up and looks towards the open door. He seems confused as he searches for whatever it was that lifted him up. You ain't gonna find it, it's hot. Into the hallway, so hard to be seen, my G. Searching for a human culprit. However, it seems... The thing is that's uh, scary is the immense power that that had. That literally lifted him up with no restraint at all. It was something more sinister that disturbed his rest. Nah. This unsettling I'll give you video nightmares. was posted to the New South Wales Australia Police Force's Facebook page in April 2018. Who are we After gonna call? That a garage door oh, at the sponsors. station had been open. Police reviewed the CCTV footage to see what had happened. To their surprise, the video shows the garage door opening all by itself. When the door is about halfway up, a broom is pushed out. It stays upright, leaning. Against Yo, somebody better be still paying that cop his commission. Even though he's in the afterlife. Against the wall for a few seconds before falling to the ground. That's if crazy. You footage in slow motion, you can see that the broom is not That's almost like a security risk at that out. point. It actually appears It's opening up garage doors before coming to rest to secure the facilities. Because the footage is taken directly from the CCTV of a police station, many believe it to be genuine evidence of the supernatural. That's horrifying. Do you think is this really the work of a ghost or could there be another explanation? Dude, nobody moved that or even touch that broom. This eerie piece I of footage was uploaded that, to YouTube to believe that's a ghost. by Compo back in May of 2014. Car has ghost. The CCTV camera shows a parking lot in an unknown location. 
Before long, a car is seen exiting the car park. Watch what happens. Ain't no way. As you can see, some kind of dark figure. He, he even thought he hit somebody. He, he slammed on the brakes, even got out of the vehicle to check if he ran somebody over. The vehicle slams on its brakes and the driver hops out like, to investigate. They that look is around, insane. but there's no one there. They even inspect the car for damage, but guys, this can happen anywhere. Literally, you're traveling middle of nowhere at night. You know, you pull into a parking lot. That guy was not expecting to see that. Like, there's a 50-50 chance that you can see the supernatural even going outside of your front door. You guys even think about that? Don't be playing the elevator games. Don't don't try to attract ghosts to you. Find nothing. A second. Don't be playing with no Ouija boards or anything like that. As well. As this happens, the driver seems to pick up Dude, something. Dude, he must have been road. able to see it like completely. Like, it, to tell what it is, if he thinks that he hit something, it might, it pavement. must have been fully, like, transparent to him. Drive away. That's, that's shocking. I was caught all on so security cam. Witness? The driver and passenger clearly saw the same black figure we did, but what is it? Some have called it a shadow person, a paranormal entity that is famous for lurking in people's periphery. However, it's rare to see one so clearly on camera. Yeah, that was fully As transparent. Always, love to get your thoughts on this. Like, way to give somebody a heart attack that they're about to get life in prison for hitting a pedestrian. When Redditor Londo Lance set up a CCTV security camera outside their house, they weren't really expecting to capture any paranormal activity. When something strange popped up in the footage late one night, they were at a loss to explain it. The video clip shows a deck in the backyard of the house and was filmed sometime between 2 and 4 in the morning. Oh, the camera no. only switches on when it detects motion. See, this freaks me out because we have security cameras. And if I see something like whatever this is about to show me, like... I always make sure ain't nothing moving back there. If I get emotional here at three o'clock in the morning, trust me, I'll upload it on here. And after a few seconds, it becomes clear what triggered the camera. A strange figure lurking on the deck. Because of its distance from the camera, it's hard to make out exactly what the figure looks like. Some viewers have suggested a small girl in a fairy dress floating above the ground or perhaps an arm holding some sort of bag. Whatever the entity is, it only lingers for a few seconds before hastily moving into the house. According to the Redditor, the spot where the figure disappears is a sliding glass door leading to the kitchen. They insist that the doors never left open at night, so for the figure to move the way it does, it would have to have moved straight through a glass door. No way. Some viewers have suggested I'm not even going to lie, you need to put holy water above that sliding glass door, sort of across, entity. make Unless that a barrier so there's no entrance. Evidence, I'm serious, that works. Paranormal activity it wards off history. evil from your front door. Never answer your door when you hear a knock that you can't see nobody. Vegas Style's YouTube channel posts many different types of videos, from tech help to parodies and even skits. However, they never seem to post any paranormal footage, and that's what makes this clip extra creepy. In 2016, the channel posted this video entitled, Why You Need Security Cameras. They had apparently been notified that several people had been lurking around their house, so they decided to set up a security camera to see if they could catch the culprits in action. Sure enough, the camera did show several teens in the area, however, nothing ever seemed to come of it. Then, two years later, the same security camera captured this mysterious video as one of the residents of the house pulled up to the garage in their car. As you can see, there's something wrong with the footage. It's all pixelated and half of the screen is green. What? As the car enters the garage, a figure can be seen walking along the sidewalk towards the house. The footage remains blurry as the figure passes, then, for a split second, it clears up, revealing something truly terrifying. The figure appears to be wearing a long black coat with a white collar and has a small, pale head. 
Hey, let me ask you guys this real, real question. And I want you guys a truthful and honest opinion. What do you think the Grim Reaper looks like? Do you think he really wears that black long cloak with a scythe? I mean, or does he wear a suit, a tie, blacked out? Looks like a skeleton head. What do y'all think? Oh no, it's real thought. I mean, not a lot of people really question that because it's like so ingrained, but it's like, what does he really look like? That would be it. One viewer compared oh no, the man. figure to that of a 17th century plague doctor. That's Others scary. Did it look more like the slender man? The he ain't tall enough. Being thought to have originated on the something awful forums back in 2009. The commentator of the video mentions that the figure could hey, he's be like six one six two. He says that he recently replaced the camera's batteries and that he checked the footage the following day and it had returned to normal. If this was the case, could it have been the figure that caused the strange camera glitch in an attempt to hide its true Is there identity? any more footage though? What do you think this security camera has captured? Is it really Or does it just cut off like or that? Is there another explanation for this mysterious figure's presence? Let me know your thoughts on this one in the comments section below. That's weird. According to Redditor, the Bat Chick, residents of the neighborhood in Lessness Abbey Wood in Kent, UK are no strangers to scary recordings. The neighborhood sits near the ruins of the old Lessness Abbey. Stories surrounding the ruins say the area is haunted by the ghost of a monk who oh, used to be a no. resident of the Abbey. The ruins are also said to be... Like when I hear the Abbey or like the haunting of the... That just makes me think of the nun. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. ...be haunted by the spirit of a young girl. It's said that her heart was buried beneath the ruins of the old abbey for reasons unknown today. Considering this eerie history of hauntings, it's unsurprising that numerous residents of the area have come forward oh, with man. recordings of bizarre happenings around the neighborhood. This particular video was recorded on a CCTV camera posted outside a house in the area. The video begins with a black and white shot of two cars parked in the driveway and a few trash bins scattered around. A few seconds into the video, one of the trash bins begins to slowly move forward in between the two cars. After a few slow stops and starts, the bin gains momentum and rolls out into the street. Hey, respect to that ghost because he actually cared about the paint jobs of both vehicles. Like that could have went super south. I mean, it's like, I'll pull it right through. Don't worry. He's taking out the trash. Some who have seen Somebody the video pay him. that it can easily be explained by gravity. The bin has wheels, so if the driveway was uneven, the bin could easily nah. roll down. No, nope. However, nah, that, nah, that's that speed. there are only two wheels on the back of the bin. Trash bins are usually designed, so the weight of the contents will prevent it from rolling on its own. And the momentum was immediate. Because the bin stops and starts numerous times and ends its roll by making a sharp turn, it couldn't be moving simply because of gravity. Yeah, because that's going uphill. If you really look at it, it's going uphill. So that going left is going uphill. Could one of the Abbey's mysterious ghosts be interfering with this bin? Oh no, man. That's weird. Here's At least they took out the trash for you. It was uploaded to YouTube by Machiavelli Illavacum way back in 2012. Some have called it a demon possession caught on camera. Take a look. As you can see. Could you imagine being the person that was in that back aisle right behind this guy and that just happened? Like, I would be immediately running out just... <laughs> Like, I would not be playing. I'd, I'd be like on the phone with the priest. Hey, you got a guy getting possessed in the gas station. See, the man in the store begins to writhe about and shriek. Hear that? That's goes schizophrenic. On time alarming the other patrons. While some viewers have called this a seizure or some kind of medical episode, it's what happens at the end of the clip that makes the whole video that much more creepy. Let's take a look. A strange reflection passes on the glass of the refrigerator to the left. Then several rolls of toilet paper inexplicably fall to the ground. 
Nah. No hope. It's these telling details that have driven thousands of viewers to nope. call this a demonic possession caught on camera. I agree. But That's what horrifying. Do you think? He, he just got possessed at a gas station, sinister. people. Let me know in the comments section below. Homie was just going in to get apple juice. Well, that does it for this video, guys. If you guys did enjoy, make sure to smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, turn on post notifications. Also, this is Rocky, our German Shepherd Corgi Mix. He's three years old. You guys want me to introduce him to the channel? Um, so here he is. And if you guys did enjoy, make sure to comment down below what clip was the scariest video for you. I would have to say this gives you a whole different perspective on, you know, things can happen to you anywhere you go in the public. I mean, the guy got possessed in the gas station. Things were getting pushed at a shopping mall or a shopping center a cart was i mean this can happen anywhere even in your own home but gives you something to think about other than that i'm gonna see y'all in the next video peace